Good afternoon, Samurai! Welcome to the stream, welcome to the channel, welcome to the Vortex. My name is Ezio and I will be your guide this afternoon as we venture across paths very well travelled at this point. Hell! Stray Girl. Hail! Real Spawn. Ah, I think that's everything. Hail Spizzness, I suppose, either which way. To each and every one of you, be you a chatter, be you a lurker. Welcome. For those of you who couldn't join us on the previous leg of our journey, we ventured forth across Camarocho to a hospital, in fact. And we stopped Mine. Huzzah! Story is over. We finished the story. We have done all of the story things, including the last of the sub-stories, if you don't count the Amon fight. And now we are in the closing chapter, the final stretch, the end of the journey, or journey's end, as I call it. We have... Uh, was it about five more items to mod of which I had to do some grinding in the Colosseum but I'll get to that later and we have all the Minamina fights to do apart from the ones that we've already done as part of the weapon modding and then we've got Amon to fight and then that's it the game is over the journey is done and we move on to the next destination which is going to be Batman Arkham City so will we get to it by the close of the stream who knows but all I can say is this come Join me as we once more step foot into the Vortex as we continue to travel and traverse the world, the realm of Yakuza 3 Remastered. Our destination lays before us, the controls are set, and as always, the PlayStation still needs to be turned on, so let's go! Shall we? Boop. It's also rather warm here today, so I've done away with my usual coffee and I'm having a Red Bull. Lord help us all. Skip, 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 boop. And there we go. Load game. Here's a free. Now, for those of you who were with me previously, you will notice that we are still inside the Coliseum. This is because, to do the last couple of gear items we need to mod, we need the Weapon Master Gem, of which it is only available as part of the Colosseum. However, unlike last time, you'll notice if we go into the exchange points, we have now 45,000 points. This is because I spent at least an hour on my day yesterday um, grinding the Colosseum. Basically, it only took me about an hour, an hour and a half, if that, but we now have 40,000 points, of which we are now going to use to buy the final two Weapon Master Gems that we need in order to finish this game. Huzzah! No! Piss off! Not going to happen! There we go. That, that was all out of order, but whatever. Right, there we go. We're done. I don't see much of that. I am disappointed. Right, come on then. Actually, come to think of it, we didn't see Majima at the end of that. We didn't have any closing scene with him. No Majima on the random street. No Majima anywhere. He, he's just he's just gone. <laughs> no waifu. Bye waifu. Actually, farewell waifu. We shall see you in the next game. How many fights did you win in total? About mm, seven, maybe eight? Not that many. I, I did the silver rank one, so I didn't have to... Hello. Shida, what are you doing here? Who do you send? Shida, yeah. where have you been? Oh, just great, thanks for asking. The boss only hit me with four hammers yesterday. I don't have much in terms of accommodation to offer you, but you're free to rest here until dusk if you want. Sound kind of nice. Uh... Oh. Yeah, I think I'll kick back for a while. It's just a bare bones prefab, but it's yours! Cool. Huh. 
Oh, I suppose if I want to go and talk to Majima, I just go into the underground place. But that's fine, I'll, I will leave Majima to Majima. Instead, we will go and finish the game. Oh, on second thoughts, no, actually, I want to go and talk to Majima. <laughs> He's either going to be in his headquarters under in the in the thing, or it's going to be he's going to be off at uh, New Serena still. Hello, waifus. No, it's not Yakuza Four yet, but it will be. Soon, TM. Hey, old hoodlum, welcome. So what are we doing? We are going to finish the weapon mods. But first, I'm going to go to this house here and see if Majima is still around, because we are not going to see him for a long time after this. So, yes. We shall go and see the crazy Cyclops dogman one more time. And by that, I mean... Not at all, because we can't actually access the underground thing. So he, maybe he's in Serena. We'll go and visit New Serena later. And failing that, then we don't see Majima again. It's kind of sad, really. Unless we, you know, do the tag team tournament thing. Farewell, waifu. Farewell, waifu. Goodbye, waifu. Goodbye, waifu. Farewell. Goodbye. Farewell. Goodbye. <laughs> Johnny. Later. That's not strictly true, but you won't see it. It's not strictly true that you won't see him, but reasons. Well, unless Majima's in Batman Arkham City, I don't think we're seeing him for a while. <laughs> the florist isn't around at this point either. Ah, shame. Oh, well. That's a wall. There we go. He could be in Tears of the Kingdom. Oh yeah, that's a point actually. Probably, it probably will be Tears of the Kingdom directly after uh, Arkham City. So yeah. <laughs> Right, mod weapons. Let's get these done. Wooden driver. You. Son of a... Mother... Do I need super resin for anything else? No, marvellous. Right, back to the blasted empty lot again. Is that the last weapon? No. No, it is not the last weapon. Majima is voiced by Mike, Mark Hamill. So, yeah, technically, unless someone else voiced Joker in Arkham City. No, no, it, it was Mark Hamill. I, mean, I suppose in that extent, yes, but... Majima, Joker... Mm, I'm going to take Majima. Slightly less likely to gouge my eyes out. Likely. You know what? After we've finished all the weapon mods, I am going to go to the pawn shop and I want to see how much money I can sell all of the crafting items for. Surely it must be a lot. Um, Larry. 58 Hype Man. That's his actual name, by the way. No other reason Majima hired him other than the fact that his name was Shifty Hype Man. Mr. Rideman had never anticipated being in the Yakuza, but somehow this all turned around when he met a man with an eye patch. So, oh, super resin, chunk of wood. Oh yeah, chunk of sacred wood. Do I have the chunk of sacred wood? I do not know. I must do, maybe? Unless I'm going to have to do that through the Minamina fights as well. Um... Uh, 
Monk of Wood, Sacred, Gambling Hall, 200 points, or Mahjong, 20,000 sticks. Okay, we're going to have to go to the Gambling Hall. Wait, Ryugi- Oh, son of a dingus. Ugh. Okay, well, that's another thing that we need to do. This game just won't let me go, will it? <laughs> Wait, is Mahjong... Hmm. It's gonna be Lullaby Mahjong, isn't it? Um, oh, Orchid Palace, okay. I have to go to Ryukyu anyway, so fine. Seems a bit overkill to go all the way to Okinawa, but whatever. out on me there. Right, so, go and get the chunk of sacred wood. Marchong is in the southmost part, uh, purple location, Camarocho North here. Yep, no, that's fine. It's, uh, I just wanted to double check that what the name of the Marjong Palace was, because if it was the wrong place, then there was no point. Um... Chunk of sacred... Okay. Sure. Whatever. I could have got the blue dragon brooch long before this point, but okay, fine. Oh, not Mahjong, don't worry, we're not going to play Mahjong. That's why I went to the gambling hall rather than the Mahjong parlor. And uh, now we just need to go up to the Kamiyama Works and get ourselves the last few items before we go back to Kamarocha. Uh, oh, there's the door. Aha, that makes more sense. It's made of wood rather than concrete. There's the Patriarch's driver. Gone. Next, we need the Blue Dragon. Good news. At least I know where to find the blue dragon brooch. Uh, and we literally, we have an item box literally next door, so that's fine. Not like I haven't learned my path from here to the gambling hall off by heart at this point, considering the amount of faff we went through with Haruka. Ugh. Right, blue dragon brooch.
And even then, this is still not as egregious as all the collecting effort I'm still doing in Assassin's Creed Syndicate. <laughs> Seriously, I've, I've kind of lost my patience with that game at this point, with the amount of random bollocks that I have to collect. So is that the last of the mods being done? Yep, this is the last of the mods being done. These are the last... We have one, two, three, four, five, six... Six more to do. There's the blue dragon bat. Dragon Knuckles. Yeah. Dragon Knuckles done. Now we just need the Dragon Taiko Sticks and the Double Broadswords. I get the right ones. <laughs> dragon Tycho Sticks, Dragon Tycho Sticks. Yep, that's it. Syndicate is easier to 100% than Yakuza 3. Assassin's Creed 1 to 3 the, and most of the others are where the pain are because of multiple cities and other locations. Uh, I mean, it's not multiple cities, but Syndicate, Syndicate's London and it has a lot of districts. And a lot of treasure chests. And a lot of helix glitches. And then there's the pressed flowers and the secrets of London. And half of which these are just put into the game to push you to the microtransaction store. Admittedly, Yakuza 3 has its difficulties. But I can't say it's not entertained me. <laughs> the Colosseum's a bit mind-numbing, yes. But that's one mind-numbing thing. The rest of it's not too... Egregious? Well, uh, it's rather egregious. But I'd rather have something piss me off than bore me to sleep. <laughs> if that makes any sort of sense. Um, right, uh, I've just done the Dragon Tycho sticks, haven't I? So now we need the double broadswords. <laughs> That is the last weapon. Gear and accessories. So we need the gauntlets, uh, right, arm guards and shin guards. And in typical fashion... Oh, wait a minute, never mind. <laughs> Kamiyama arm guards. And Kamiyama shit guards. Mm. Oh. Oh, there we go. I like boring more because all you need is the mu is music and not pay attention to the game while collecting everything. Yeah, but it's a waste of... I find it a massive waste of my time. <laughs> I, I I say that aware of the irony of the fact that I'm also doing it for the sake of getting my 100%. So it is what it is. Sometimes it's okay, but... but that there is a certain limit of which I what I can take in terms of running around on a collector phone. And there we go. So, all being well, 632 out of 632. There we go. That's all of the completion list done. Everything done. At one time, good luck. Well, not quite yet. We've still got to wrap a few things up here and there, haven't we? Ah, 
And our last text from Sayama. Hold on, just need to... What's that? That's okay. There we go. E. Do we? Yes, we do. <laughs> we can't fight Amon yet, on the principle that we haven't actually got the mission, we haven't completed enough of the game to actually get him unlocked. All will become apparent soon. Congratulations, Kazuma. You've attained every modded weapon. Man, love what modern we modern their toys, I suppose. Anyway, I have a gift for you. Bobu Tamiya is holding it for holding on to it for you. So go find him if you want to pick it up. He's somewhere around town. Don't worry if you lose it. You can always get it from him again. Love you. I'm guessing Sayama's profile is now locked in. Yeah, has left the United States to pursue her dream. So, yeah, we've not got any difference with that. Check your stats. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, no, I've still got 160 left to do. I mean, probably by the end of the Ammon fight, we'll have got enough XP to get the final level, but, yeah, I don't know. But you, I do know what I do know now, and that is we need to go to the airport and back to Camarocha. And to save the game. Oh, and we need to talk to Bob. Hmm. Oh, the game stats. Oh, well, we need to go to Serena anyway, so... Oh, sorry. Hey, Bob. Oh, yeah. Kiryu-san, Lady Siyama, left another present for you. Still warm to the touch. The Dragon Emblem Sword. Awesome. There we go. Uh, oh, right, yeah, and I've said the uh, new Serena is on the street. Cool. And I've got a fancy new sword. Nice. A sword that's shrouded in mystery. It must be rare and historic. All in turn, welcome. Okay, so we have Haruka. We have Rikia, who is still alive and well, actually. That's a. Hey, Kiri, been painting the town red out there? Mm, something like that. Right here. By the way, if you ever want to replay a main story with the stats you've got now, I can set that up for you. Taking it, okay, cool. Uh, no! <laughs> I, I'm quite alright, thank you. So, it's good to know, so I could play New Game Plus after I've maxed out everything on Kiri. Uh, no, I'm alright, don't rest. Well, we all right, we were checking our stats. So no Majima, so that's fine. We'll see Majima again so someday, I suppose. Wait, difficulty set to normal now? Is that because we're playing in premium adventure? annoyed me. <laughs> Can I turn it up? Uh, no. Did that to me in Yakuza 4. Well, okay, so we're not going to beat Tam on, on uber hard difficulty. Maybe that's why it went e I found the Colosseum a bit easier. Or maybe not, who knows. Either way, I'm not going to sweat it because... That said, even if I'm on normal difficulty, I still found the the, the, the angry serpent man a pain in the neck, so maybe I'll be all right. Either way, let's go and wrap up the last of the Mitsumisha Mababa Dubida missions so we can unlock the Amon fight. Minimeter, even. That's who I'm thinking of. Do, 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 do. 
do 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 people I need to fight again and then that's done as well so that's not too bad. Beep boop beep bop beep boop beep. to play. So we've done Lethal Warrior, we've done Greedy Giant, we've done One-Eyed Demon. We've done the Avenging Berserker, so we've just, you've just got the Fighting God now. I don't think of it, we didn't see Joji at the end of that either. Oh no, no, he was in the helicopter. Never mind. He was in the helicopter with Haruka because everyone who knows Kiryu immediately concludes we must take Haruka into the war zone to see her father. <laughs> Just what? One of these days, go, that'll happen, and somebody will be on the roof of an RPG, and that'll be it. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
I might run out of time on this one. Never mind. Oh, nine seconds to spare. I will choose. Press foot stamps to help avoid infant. Okay, cool. I think that's all of them, isn't it? Huh. Cool. Wait, did I have to fight Majima again? Yes, I did. I had to fight him for something. I can't remember what. Okay, so we've done that all twice. So now we go back to the castle and find and talk to Duda. I'm also kind of expecting a phone call or a text message or something. That didn't work. Hmm. I have to fight everyone a third time? Or did I miss one? done all the sub stories you did all the hitmen training and sub stories so that's really weird now as soon as you talk to minamina i'm uncautious oh oh maybe i need to talk to him an, an extra time Palomino, oh. welcome. Oracle says you need to wait till night. Oh! Well, <laughs> Palomino swoops in like usual to save the day. Right, let's go and find... Oh, I'm going to have to go all the way back to Serena now. Oh, no, I don't. I can go straight up to... I can just stay in a few hours in the Majima family office instead. A family office. Even if it is just a prefab with a telephone that laughs maniacally at me. Because of course it does. Machida. Rest until evening. Okay, there we go. It's night time. I mean, I assume it's night time.
It is night. Well, I wasn't sure. It said evening. <laughs> No, if it got darker. <laughs> Go talk to Minamina again. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Boo -doo, boo -boo -boo. Well, in fairness, we have um, well over three hours of the stream left. I, I think we, we don't have to rush too hard, he says. Completely ignorant of how bad the Amon fight is probably going to be in this game. I need to talk to Minamina then. Maybe I need to go down to the chap in the castle and talk to him instead. And if all else fails, I'll just have to go through each fight one by one again and see if I can find out what's going on. The Ammon is one of the easier Ammon fights. Four is the opposite, but just tiger drop him. Fair enough. way. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Do you know a man named Minamina? He's actually calling himself Dr. Minamita. Yeah, I know him. Oh, you do? What about him? While we were collecting information on the hitman, the name Minamita came up. You mean Minamita over... Wait, you mean Minamita is one of the hitmen? Well, no, but... Come on. What's wrong? We came across his name while we were hunting for information on a mysterious man named Amon. This Amon seems to be a headman himself. He apparently works for some mysterious organization, and people say that if he targets you, you're as good as dead. Oh. Him. Yeah, I know him. <laughs> Actually, before we found out that the Rase san was the man behind the Reapers, we thought Amon was his ringleader. We keep running into walls. Minamita is the only solid lead we could get. He was the president of a video game company that went bankrupt. So, how was Minamita connected to Amon? We're not sure, but based on the information we gathered, it seems you've become one of Amon's targets. You want to tell him? <laughs> We're certain Minamida is linked to Amon, so if he's a friend of yours, please be very careful. Got it. Could the Minamida I know be linked to Amon? That sounds crazy, but Ibuki's info seems solid. Still, Minamida hasn't been acting strangely. I'll just have to see how things turn out. And now I guess we go back and talk to Minamita. All these Amon fights remind me of the very, very last fight in Judgment. It's so hard. Oh, well. Something to look forward to then. Oh, then again, given, given my MO, maybe I won't find it so hard if I'm overpowered up the wazoo. Mm-hmm, yes, that's the hard of mm -hmm. Or maybe I will. Who knows? It's a long way in the future at this point. I heard uh, the one in Last Judgment is incredibly broken. Ah, 